transmissions have evolved from the two-speed power glide to the eight-speed to 10-speed automatic transmissions today. Welcome to this AMS oil tech tip. Well, how did that all happen? It's all about the valve bodies, my friends. It causes the shifts. What is it and how does it work? Well, you can see it right here. It actually has a bunch of valves located in there. Shift valves, modulator valves, reverse valves, manual valves, everything that's directed in that fluid to different chambers to make it happen. Here's one right here and you can see all these passages right here, all these nooks and crannies cause that fluid to run around and go into the transmission at different points to achieve the different shifts. We're talking about shift solenoids right here. Those cause different shifts, one, two, three, four. This is a pressure control solenoid. Now all these solenoids and valves, they make the shift happen. Now Lynn, could you tell us, explain how this chart works? This is how it actually happens. I think if you can understand that, you can land on the moon. <laughs> Absolutely. It's a complex machine, but it all starts here at the pump, and then it goes through all those passages to make the shift happen. That's good enough, Len. But a little bit earlier, I actually measured this. This is a manual valve, and your shift's connected to it, and you move it back and forth. I measured it with this veneer caliper here from the inside and the out, Len, and I have a little bit of thousands, not too much play in there, and fluid has to make those valves move. How right. does that happen? That space that you're talking about, I mean, that's less than a sheet of paper, so there's not a lot of room for anything but the fluids. So the fluid has to remain fluid. Uh, so we're talking about detergency. We don't want to have buildup. We don't want to have varnish or any type of depositing in there or it can create sticking. Now I see that a lot. These things get varnished up. The fluid's in there too long. You might have shift problems. It may be just as simple as changing your fluid or maintaining your fluid. Check them out on the website at amsoil.com.